Oh, no, you're going back. I want to go back to the city. But no, I can't. There's an invisible wall. God damn it. Oh, well. Off to meet death, I guess. This is exactly the same place they were before. She's going to the mine. God damn it, May. Oh, it's the guy. What are you? Are you actually a ghost? Or just some guy? What is this thing in my head? Are you doing this? Why is this happening to me? Talk. Fine, let's do this. What? Whoa, mate. Whoa! What is this? Who did? Oh, guys, I love you so much. Boom. Get away from her, you piece of shit. Oh, you're outnumbered, asshole. Ah, you shot me. And we can you and we can all use both of your arms. I will personally disassemble you. Oh shit, Bay. Oh jeez, B. Uh, oh. Shit, I guess he wasn't a ghost. You okay? Where did what are where well he's wounded. Sounds like he went back up to the mine. Yeah, what do we do? Follow him, I guess. No, I have to go alone. You all wait here, I'll go. Mm. Hmm. Anyway, yeah, anyway. If he's up in a mine, we might be able to corner him and tie him up or something. Can you walk, May? Uh, I think so. Might be a little slow. I'll help you if you need it. Thanks, big guy. All right, let's go do something really stupid. Gates open. Oh, jeez. What? We could, like, block it shut or something. Oh, dang. You're right. No. He, it, whatever. I have to go down in there. Really? Well, then. Looks like all of his friends are gone. Just one guy. Just one guy. Just one something. Bang, bang. May, you don't think it's a guy? <laughs> this is great. I can, I can only see. Well, this isn't dangerous or anything. Uh, nothing to be scared of down there. Just a party. <laughs> Not too late to throw ourselves into traffic instead. What? Uh, but I wanted to say that I like that we can only see B's cigarette. I mean, not only. We can see a bit, but not much. Is there, there, are there a door over there? I think so. Okay, so there's a hole. Looks like he took the elevator down. Oh, it's an elevator. So much for the element of surprise. He's gonna hear us coming a mile away. We sure want to do this? Yeah, May, you sure? Guys, I don't know if you understand. <coughs> He's in my head. I can't function like this. Everything is dying or dead already. Uh, I don't know what's gonna happen down there. Okay then, we'll come out of this together. Oh, that is loud. Ugh, that thing, that thing looks old. They haven't used this mine in like a lot of years. Generations even. Are you our tour guide now? Seriously, Bay. B. We have Possum Springs tourism pamphlets, pam pamphlets at the shop, and I get bored. This is in the brochure. <laughs> I guess there are many things in, in those brochures. 
Well, here we are. <coughs> May, you okay? I have my inhaler. No, I'm fine. It's just like... It's like something huge is on top of me. I mean, technically, you're not wrong. Yeah, they are in a mine. Is it like asthma? That's how asthma is. No, it's not asthma, big guy. But thanks. Shh. I hear something. Down there. You going to be okay, May? Yeah, I'm alright. We should be quiet. Yeah, I gotta save up for screaming later. <laughs> oh, B. I mean, that's probably true. Oh, this is so cool. I, lo I love how, how this darkness around this uh, mine shaft looks like night sky with single stars shining. This is so pretty. And door. Door. Tunnel. Whatever. I think I can hear. Here we go. I think I can hear some voices like whispering or murmuring. That's creepy. What is this? Some construction? Wait, there is a pentagram. Oh my god. Oh, jeez. What is this place? Looks like a church or something? And like junk? Oh god. Oh god. What is it? It's here. It's here. Oh god. What? What is it? I don't know, but it's here. It's through there. But what? What is? What? But can you see the pentagram? Like turned upside down over there? Jesus. Oh no, it's getting darker. Should we go there? Now I can actually see only B's light. Can, do you have like a lighter? Maybe we can use it? That would be great because you're constantly smoking cigarettes so you probably have a lighter. Unless you are smoking, I mean starting one cigarette from another. Oh, I know you're in here. Say something. Well, how about this? Take a couple more steps forward if you want to die. What? Show yourself! Yeah, asshole, we're like five times scarier than you. <laughs> oh. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, shit. Oh, that's unfortunate. There they are. They, they are right there. Here, there. I'm gonna kill them! Aid, you do no such thing. Aid? It's out of your hands now. He shot me! And I'd say we are even. Little girl got shot at the other night. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah. You're apologizing? It was a bad call. I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. I didn't actually, it didn't actually hit me, so... Wait, what the, who are you? Bunch of old boys doing their damnest to protect their own and their neighbors. Then why are you trying to kill me? Kill you? Nobody's gonna kill you. All of you are part of this town. By family relation or just by being hard workers. Contributors. Uh, okay. So we could just leave? Well, he brought you down here for a reason. And he's not gonna let you leave until he's had his say. Huh? Well, he's already got an arrow through the shoulder. I don't think he's gonna be having much say in whatever. Huh? Wait, so you think that aid? He kidnapped that kid at Harfest. He's been in my head somehow. I'm always tired, constant headaches. He's been following me, following all of us. He... 
Oh, little girl, you don't know what this is, do you? What? Oh, God. I've seen this. Or I've felt it. Was Ed Scudder and Jim Dorney who found it? Huh? 20 years back or so, you mean the hole? After the West Mine closed out past Br Brittle. Vest Shoe Sh Schumacher, last supervisor, was out there when the company locked off the entrance. Carved his initials and date in the door. Then you got this mine, the old one. Not even a proper mine, big hole, copper. Abandoned shoot long before any of us were born. Too close to water, and that water was poison. When the first settlers came out here, that old spring used to be right above where we're standing, but that water dried up. 1992 or so when some men from West Mine come back up here to try bootlegging, practically built a new elevator, got the main tunnel cleared. Never found no coal, just dug deeper and deeper till Ed busts through that wall and finds this place. And Jim walks right into that hole and never hits bottom. Huh? Ed calls down to Jim. Jim doesn't answer. But someone else does. What? I know you heard that voice, girl. What? In dreams and in waking times. So what brought you down here? What? What? <laughs> so what does this have to do with you or me or anyone? You got to understand. In those days, it was the end of the world. Jobs gone, our kids were leaving. Government didn't care, only wanted our votes. Just putting in more regulations, sending our jobs overseas. Spending our taxes on lazy people and immigrants. While we worked ourselves to death. Yeah, mm. Oh, here we go. God damn, I hate this crap. You old dipshits. You finished? Yeah, sure. We prayed and prayed up at the church. But when Ed Scudder came back down here and listened, he got answers back. Oh god, I think I know. Answers? I think I know. Are those the same visions? Yes, he was already in there singing to you, right? Oh, is this the cat god? I... Ed explained it to a few folks and they didn't believe it. But he was persuasive. He had the glimmer. The glimmer? Once he fakes a shining too, it rubs off on, off on you. You can do things. I never seen it, but they said Ed could walk through walls. What? Okay. After Ed talked us into all this, after that first time, after we picked one out, well, Oh, not only was the town holding stable, but it was almost like we were getting younger and money came too. Still a few of us left from back then. Picked? First time? Picked? Who? First one was Tom Turner, who believed you, me, was a bastard. Just pure trash. We got him down here and in the hole he went. The next week, flowers blooming all, all over the hills. You throw them in, t in the hole? Uh, they're feeding him. He's hungry like you wouldn't believe. Every few months or so, he starts singing. And it's someone's turn to find someone. Was that what you were doing the other night? I mean, at the Harfest? No. What happened the other night was a shame. Oh no, the, the moment they killed that guy, one of our number broke the rules and had to pay up. That was a hard thing to do. I think I'm gonna be sick. We never pick no one who's gonna be missed. That's a solid rule. Hmm. Drifters, drunks and delinquents. <gasps> Did you kill Bruce? 
or maybe Bruce got a scent of you and decided to, you know, leave because he knew that you were, you know, eyeing him for this thing. You've been, oh God, oh no. How many people have died? Casey? The Hartley kid? All he was gonna contribute to society, except a bunch of kids growing up with no dad, was a rap sheet a mile long before whatever sad end he would wind up at. We did him a favor. You killed Casey? Oh my god. We don't use that word. You know he was stacking up taking up business with his cousin, right? What business? You know what happened to his, to his cousin. Burned alive when his little trailer lab exploded. They had to wear hazmat suits when they cleaned him up. Oh my god. That's where Casey was headed. You killed Casey? Anyone to act like we didn't do him and his whole town a favor? Oh god, Casey's been down here the whole time. His parents put up posters. Maybe they should have cared more about him before it came to this. Oh, you assholes. Which one of you did it? Greg. He was my friend. All right, now throw it down right now or I will shoot. <laughs> what if I get you first? Bolt sticking right out of your eye. Bang. Bang. You brought guns down here? Dangerous this far out in the woods at night. Basic safety. I... Throw it down, son. Don't make this our time. Greg. Dang it. My god. You monsters. None of this... None of this is happening. Oh... May, we are not monsters. I don't think it's a good time to faint. And what is happening? This is pretty, but... Oh my god, May, I think you're losing it. We do it because we love our home. As long as we keep doing this, Possum Springs survives. Things can get better. These mines are gonna be humming again someday. Old mills puffing smoke. You kids don't understand that we lost what our world was built around. Used to be you provided for a family, brought a house. Now you're stocking shelves at the grocery store. Kids living more than they're staying. No opportunity here. Old people dying, houses left empty. You ever seen that? A home become a tumbled in pile of wood and plaster? A job become a burned out brick box or a hole in the ground? But we can change that. We can put this place back together where it won't be just shapes. Oh God, May. I'm going to die down here. Oh no, you don't. Not on my watch. Why are you telling us all this? Because we're getting old. And even with the French benefit of good health, we need new blood to carry this on when we, when we are gone. Really, you're like pitching us on this? Were any of you even miners in, back in the day? Any of you hurting now, financially like? Or is this just some big costume party murder club for someone's shitty boss who's afraid of dying? Ooh, that don't matter. Oh, it does. <laughs> oh yeah, this is real bad. This is insane. Why should we help you? Why shouldn't we just call the cops? I mean, I think the cops are among those people. I mean, not the aunt, but maybe. And say what? You saw some men you can't identify. 
in an abandoned mine behind a locked gate, and an elevator that won't run, that you saw a hole. Okay, fine, why should we help you? Oh, I should have asked that before. Because if no one is here to do this, you remember that flood a few years back? You remember the blizzard of 2010? That would ha that's what happens. And beyond that, the jobs never come back, the kids never come back. Everything crumbles, Possum Springs bleeds to death. And soon we'll all be dead, and this town will be just fields and trees. I've seen it. I know you have. What? Why? I'll, I'll understand if you need some time to think it over. So we can leave? No one's gonna stop you. But understand that you don't know who we are. Out there. But we know who you all are. Ain't fair they, they get to leave and I probably got permanent damage. Shut up, Aid. You don't know a thing about what he wants, what he is. Aid, I swear to God. Let's go. Yeah, let's seriously get out of here. Son, you leave that crossbow. What? Why? Well, I could bullshit you. But the truth is, I just don't trust you. Fine, whatever, it's a piece of shit anyway. <laughs> I can't move, you guys. I'll carry you. Oh, Angus, you're the sweetest. I have no idea what to even think about any of this. It's just horror. That's not a word you get to use too often. That's all I've got left. Like everything else in my head is gone. Let's get out of here fast. I don't know if I... Shh. Talk later. Oh, Angus, you're the best. Old, old stuff in here. <laughs> you mean the elevator or the guys below? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to put you down for a sec, okay? Okay. So, Casey. Yeah. I... Yeah. And for what? I think I get it. Wow, really? Too tired to explain it right, but like... They lost what they thought was gonna happen, which was what had happened like a long time ago, or how they remembered, or how they picture it, and things it gave them. And so Casey and that kid at Harvest and... Sorry, I lost it. That's more sense than I can make of it. They're sad. It's all really sad. You ready to go again? Yep, sorry. Wait, everybody shut up. I can hear something. What? Shh, I thought I... Oh no, the, the light's going out. Oh no! Ah! Shit, the guy! Oh no, be help, help! Oh! Oh, oh yes, kick him! Kick him! In the light! <gasps> oh shit, this is bad. Dude, this is bad. <gasps> and the arm. Oh no, we are all gonna die. Did we die? Holy shit! Is everyone okay? May? May, are you okay? May, say something! <laughs> <laughs> May? <laughs> uh. <laughs> Shh, it's okay. It's okay, I've got you. He's gone now. Shit, how are we gonna get out of here? Shh, give her a minute. Oh my dear God. I feel air coming in from somewhere. So we're not gonna suffocate. Okay, well, that's a relief. How do you... I was a scout, Greg. I was a scout. 
Hey, Angus. Yeah? I love you. Aww. Welcome back, May. You okay? Better now that I almost got murdered. Again. Which is weird. <laughs> that was like the third time in two days. Oh yeah, but third time's the charm. I hope not. Guys, the air is coming from back here. All right, I'm up. You sure? Yeah, I think I can walk at least. It's boarded up a long time ago. Can we get through? Let's find out. Let's get out of here. Uh, come on. Let's grab it. Okay. Uh, oh, friends. Helping hands. That's so nice. Yep, that's some fresh air. Oh, all right. <laughs> and water. Dude, that's amazing. You can smell water? Hopefully it's not a river. Cave rivers are dead traps. Mine river. We're in a mine. Right. Oh my god, she can even run. Hmm. I can see the bottom. I don't think we're gonna die in the one foot of water. Right. Okay, let's go. I oh what? What? What is happening? I know what you are now. I think I knew before. But, you know, after I sent that kid to the hospital years ago, they said I had an anger problem. But that's not true. I was angry because of something else. Something I'd lost. Trying so hard since not, being, not to be angry got me all defenseless. And I lost more and more and more. That's not getting better. I want to be angry. When I ran home from college, on the bus I had this dream. Or maybe I saw it out the window. Last leaf on a tree. Finally blown off. I'm so scared. All the time. And the fear hurts. Feeling like everything is over. Was over long before, before I got here so long hiding or trying to outrun this i get it this won't stop until i die but when i die i want it to hurt when my friends leave when i have to let go when this entire town is wiped off the map i want it to hurt bad i want to lose i want to get beaten up i want to hold on until i'm thrown off and everything ends and you know what? Until that happens, I want to hope again, and I want to and I want it to hurt. Because that means it meant something. It means I'm something at least. <laughs> Pretty amazing to be something, at least. Blah, blah, blah. What? You know I can't understand you, right? Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> oh shut up already. I know this won't save me in the end, but I don't need it to save me forever. I just need it to save me now. So if you're gonna kill me right here, then do it. If not, then don't. <laughs> May! Dude, you okay? Whoa. You got all sleepwalky there for a second. You want me to carry you? No, I think I'm good. I'm just... Very, very tired. Hang here for a bit if you need to. We're safe. Uh-huh. I hope so. Hey, there's light over there. Did you smell that? I bet he did. <laughs> All right, so um, what do we do now? Because was that Cthulhu? Because I got that vibe. Like, did you talk to the old gods? All right. Is this the shaft we saw at the at the walk with mom? What is this? Might be a vent or something. Keep the miners from suffocating way back when. Looks old enough at least. Huh? 
brochure. Hello, we're down here. Don't ask us why, please. Could get lucky and someone's out here in the woods at night. I can try to make it out. No, I can like... Hmm. Okay, yeah, you're up for this? Yeah, no, yeah, I don't know. I'm like all hyper now, like dolphins. Hyper like dolphins? No, like when your body is like, oh, oh, I almost died. And you get all hyper because you're filled with dolphins. Uh, I, okay, I'm seriously confused. Are you okay, mate? Endorphins. Oh, okay. There, thank you, those. Okay, well, write do those dolphins up out of here. <laughs> yeah, write those, those dolphins. That's assuming I can even do this. We'll watch. Okay. Okay, so we're getting up. And, oh my god, if it's the same field we saw when we were out with mom. It's getting um, less, I mean, thinner. I hope we manage to get to the... Oh, we are already there. Oh, it's not. It's so well in the forest. Uh, oh. Oh. You made it, May. I'm so proud. This place. Huh. Hey, May. Germ? Yeah. What are you doing out here? I live up right up the hill. I heard Greg yelling. We were all stuck down there. You were at the bottom of the old well in my backyard? It's been a really bad night. Sounds like it. Got any rope or something? Yeah. Can you get it? <laughs> oh my god. Hey, May. Yeah. Was that germ? Yeah, he's getting some rope. What is he doing out here? He lives here. In the woods? Yeah, I, I guess it's suspicious. <gasps> My entire body hurts. That was a long way. I brought some sodas. You're the best germ. You need the sugar and caffeine. This is so weird. Uh-huh, I want anyone else want to get far away from this well? Yep. Germ, can you like, I don't know, seal up this this well? Hmm. Yeah. I get dynamite. What? Yeah, I mean, I can get some. How big an explosion is that? I mean, not small. Okay, that works. Thanks, Germ. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Um, okay. This is so weird. I don't like this music. It's ominous. And Germ is acting weirder than usual. And I feel like... Bye, guys. And I feel like he's gonna betray us or something. Like, there goes a weird, weird guy. He saved our lives. Germ is good. Germ is a good man. But weird. And to be honest... It strikes me that we just murdered all of those dudes down there. How do you figure? Well, I mean, the elevator's broken and we caused a cave-in. That was self-defense. I guess, but we did cause the deaths of like a dozen guys. No, 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 they're all still alive down there. Hmm, I don't think so. Oh God, yeah, jeez. Well, we're blameless. They attacked us. One of them attacked us. So we're worrying about like... Um, seriously, they were murdering people. I'm not saying, you know, it's 100% justified. It's morally gray. I agree with that, B. We're not murderers. I mean, like, if we'd had a choice, we wouldn't have done it. Maybe. I would have... Oh, shit, Angus. I didn't know you from this side. Oh. What? They, like, killed people. They were trying to get us to kill people. Screw them. 
I don't even believe in hell and I hope they all go straight there. Jeez, Angus. Well, that's what I think at least. Hmm, this is like that trolley thing. What trolley thing? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'll explain if we keep walking. Yeah, let's leave this place. But what trolley thing? Do I forget something? Hey guys! We're back at home. Uh, are you there? I guess not. Anyone? Okay, I'm gonna type anyway. Hard for me to say anything smart about what the hell even just happened. Easier for me to get it all out here. And I need to talk. Even if you jerks are off doing whatever. None of us asked for any of this. And it didn't happen to us because we're like special. You can work as hard as you want, but the universe is gonna keep doing what it does. And I don't think any of us deserve this all. This is all stuff that started long before we were born. It's all like moving so fast and you're dropped into it. And you're just trying to grab onto something. All of you are what keep me, what kept me from floating off tonight. Also, you kind of killed that guy to save me. Don't think I didn't appreciate that. LOL. <laughs> I don't know if I'm ever gonna understand what all just happened. I hope it stopped. I just feel right now like all I want to do is wrap my arms around all of you, not just because I love you, but to keep you all together with me. Wrap up into a ball and no one can hurt us. Sorry, I'm rambling. Germ, buddy. Germ, you don't even use messenger. I guess I'm just typing at you wherever you are at. B, you're definitely something. I'm so sorry about all you've gone through. I don't even understand all of your problems, but if I could, I would fix them. I would fix all of it. And I would buy the tools to do it from your store. Or like borrow them at least. A better friend would buy, but I'm what she got. <laughs> oh my god. And I'm glad. Yep, there it is. Now I'm just gonna erase all that. Uh oh. Oh shit. Hi <laughs> guys, I was just kidding about a lot of stuff. I'm really tired. I don't know what I'm saying. Log off, May. Log off. 